What do you mean he's gone? He's been shot. That's his blood. Well, he was here. Kate, he must have taken off. What? Any idea when? where? Yeah. I think I know exactly where he went. So he didn't drive himself to the hospital? No, but our shooter might be. I got off a shot before he took off. I might have hit him. Yeah, I need you to notify all emergency rooms in Port Charles and surrounding counties. We got a possible suspect in the Metro garage shooting, possible GSW. You need to get upstairs. Kate. Kate. What? You okay? We need to get you upstairs. We'll wait up there for word about Sonny. Hey, call you. If, call me if you need me. Will do. You still didn't tell me where Sonny might have gone. Look, look I, I don't know for sure. Take an educated guess. I, I'd like to try and get. Check this out myself. It's the wrong answer. No, Mac, look, I know I got a conflict of interest here, but let me let me see if I can get through to Sonny. First, you need to tell me. Are we looking at a mob war on our hands? Maybe. Maybe not. I actually think it's more personal than that. Sonny and I were standing over here. Shot rang out from that direction. We both went down. Sonny was hit. I checked on him. By the time I, I looked, the shooter was gone. All right, fine. We'll get a team here. Meanwhile... Look, I'll find Sonny. I just need a little time. Why am I even considering Mac, this? come on, you gotta trust me. I can defuse this situation. What if you're wrong? Then I... About where Sonny is gone. Then I promise you, I will call for help Mac. myself. Mac! Mac! I'm sorry, I need a squad car. A squad car? And Molly, something's going on with her. Michael called me from her phone and I heard her yelling in the background. Well, call Michael back. If he doesn't answer, I'll take you to the house. I, we'll I find don't out need what's a going ride. On. You may not need a squad car either. You don't want this on the books if nothing's happened. And you've got an hour to find Sonny. After that, I call on an APB. <laughs> I'm gonna shoot this son of a bitch! No, Sonny, no! Where he stands! Sonny, what the hell are you doing? Take... Take Harley out of here. You know what, forget the parties and, and the donations. You really want to impress me? You put that gun down right now. Is there anything that it took a bullet for you, Dante? Yeah, you know what does. Okay. I'm calling in a favor. I want you to take Carly home. I want you to go home to your lovely wife. You were never here. Do you understand me? You know, I can't do that, Sonny. I respect your badge. I would never make you an accessory to a crime. But I'll protect my sons. I don't care whether you like it or not. I know. I get it. You are my father, and I finally understand what that means to you. You will give your life for me. But I cannot look the other way where you commit murder. Please hand that gun to me. I don't know what I'd do if I let him live. Something, something happens to you. Dante, I never... Shut up! Sonny. Sonny, give Dante the gun and go to the hospital before you pass out. Because right, you lost a lot of blood. Garage, you need to see a doctor. You can't get sent to prison. Your kids need you. Why do you always say that? When it's about something that you want. What I want is for you to step up for your kids, Sonny, and now's your chance. If you didn't try to kill Dante tonight, who did? I don't know. I wasn't there. It was some closey. Not, not your father. Maybe a grandfather. Wouldn't be the first time you went after one of yours. So it was your father who shot me at Sonny's warehouse last summer, Johnny? All I know is I didn't shoot either one of you. Maybe you can uh, talk to the police about that? Sure, I'll be happy to talk to them about what just happened here tonight, too. Yeah, sure. Sonny showed up. Harsh words were exchanged, and then Sonny went home, right, Sonny? Still got on your lucky streak there, Johnny. Not one guardian angel, but two. You don't get it, do you? This is the second time in less than a year that Dante and I have stopped you from destroying your life, or do you not see the similarities between tonight and the night you tried to kill Jax? You want me to thank you? Yeah, I want you to thank me. I want you to thank me. And I want you to let Dante take you to the hospital. You look like you're about to fall over. You know, maybe you're in shock and it's... It's messing with your judgment. Would you testify to that in a court of law? I'd rather not have to. I'll go home, Ted. 
uh, you know, Jocelyn and, and get you stay out of trouble. I'm fine. You're the one running around town with the gun. Don't take him out of here. You don't have to take me to the hospital. I gotta, I gotta go. Go fix it up. You're not gonna drive yourself. It's not far. He passed out within two blocks. I don't know how you have out of that gun as long as you did. That's what you call adrenaline. I know, uh... You went after Johnny to protect me. But not the way you want her to be protected. Sarah, it sounds like you finally heard me. And we get a chance after all. Does that mean you're going to let me give you that money then? Hell no. <laughs> I didn't think so. But, uh... Thank you. For saving my life. No, no, no. 